Um, um, uh, well. What's up guys, welcome back to Unbox Junkie. My name is Matt and today we're looking at something a little bit different. Now, I got an email in my inbox a little while back. Now, I get a ton of emails, a lot of emails, you know, suggesting to check out different products and stuff like that, but uh, this one was a little bit different in the sense that they just sent me a message saying that they sent me their product and uh, that I hope I enjoy it. Um, so I was like, that's actually really cool. I need I need more of those. <laughs> so they actually sent out a cool little product called Zentree, the black wooden edition. It's a stylish and quick USB charging station. Smart IC charging innovations for your smartphone and tablet. Now, as you can tell, it looks like a pretty basic design. It's got this nice wood on it and this black pegs sticking up. Very basic idea, but very functional, especially if you have multiple devices. Optional silicone skin sold separately, white, light gray and light pink. They're calling it the three tree array docking, seamless tech cable, smart IC auto control. Um, I'm not 100% sure what IC control is. Uh, four USB ports, it's pushing out 48 watts of power, it has soft silicone skins, and it's eco-friendly. All right, tons of cables. Power cable, oh, different kind, cool. So you've got Chinese power adapter and US power adapter comes with it. Then you got your instructions showing you installation and setup guide. I'm gonna hold on to that. Oh, cool, look at that. Oh yeah, that's all rubber. You're not gonna have to worry about scratching up your devices. That's cool. Free silicone skin add-on in exchange for your product review on Amazon. Very cool. If you purchase this, um, they're willing to just send you a free skin uh, just for leaving a product review. Very nice gesture. Okay, so the base unit itself, all right, so it's, it's not wood. It's not actual wood. It's plastic, uh, but it looks nice. It definitely has the wood grain design on it. It looks pretty clean. You got your power cable input. You got the uh, nice rubber feet on the bottom. On the inside right here, you've got your USB ports. Oh, nice. Comes with little 3M stickies so you can uh, have a little cable management. Very short USB to micro USB cables. About a foot long USB to micro USB cable and you got four of those. Plug it in right there. Since the cables aren't built into the device itself, you can use your own cable. If you want something a little longer, just so you don't have to be restricted to the unit, you can totally do that. You can put your own cable in here and that's really cool. There we go. All right, so now I got my two cables in. Is that right? Oh, well, there we go. It's got some packaging dust on it. And the silicone, oh yeah, look at that. There we go. Oh, nice. So it's just this plastic, shiny thing and then yeah these just you can just replace it with a, a different skin very cool uh let's go ahead and plug it in now the power cable itself about a five and a half foot long cable plug it in the back ah there we go now it doesn't look like there's any lights all right now i'm going to take my note 5 which is in this monstrous uh <laughs> otterbox case plug it in Okay, and then you can set it anywhere. You can set it like this, you could set it at an angle if you want to. Um, you can just put it on the short one, you can put it in the middle, and then I've got my iPhone 6, plug that in. Just gotta charge. You set it in there like that. Now, if you have more things like tablets, we got an old tablet here that uh, hit in an old video. I was attempting to use it and locked myself out of it and uh, it's permanently locked now. Let's plug in this iPad that I have locked myself out of and I do not know the password. I'm gonna try the password real quick. Hold on, nobody look. Oh God, what could it be? Nope, oh, iPad is disabled connect to iTunes, fantastic. So <laughs> you can set it up like this, or you can set it up the tall way like that if you want to. Maybe you have uh, you know, multiple people in your house and you have uh, a lot of people what they do is they have uh, a counter in their kitchen that they just plug in their phones and that's where you put it. This would be a nice little addition to have just sitting on the counter. You come by, plug it in, set it down. When you wanna use your phone, you grab it just like that. Now see this, this, this shortness, I would personally put this like next to my bed or something because I'm one of those people I use my phone for just about everything including my alarms. I'm gonna put a longer cable in here so I can I can use it a little better but uh, it's functional. It seems to uh, do the job. It's holding them in there really nicely. 
The iPad fits in there real nicely. I mean, you're gonna have cables. You're gonna you're gonna need a place to charge your phone. Why not have it in one convenient location where it keeps your phone safe? Me personally, I would probably go with like an all black or an all white or something. But uh, you know, the wood look looks pretty decent. It is a little strange just sitting there <laughs> looking at it by itself, just a bunch of pegs. Like, what is that for? If you have like a USB splitter, you might be able to put that in there and maybe get a couple more on here even. Now this actually goes for about 55 bucks. So I mean, it's you know, it's up to you really. I mean, if it's something that would solve a problem for you and make things a little more convenient for you, it might be worth it. There are a lot of different solutions out there for, you know, organizing your, your devices and charging them and everything, but uh, this is just another one. Let me know down below, what do you think of this? I think it's kind of cool. It works. All right, guys. Well, that is it. I'm going to leave a link down in the description below. As usual, you guys know what to do. Go check it out for yourself. But as for now, get out of here.